Okay, so today we're going to look at replacing a fuse in a uh, 2007, Chevy, uh, 2007 Chevy Malibu. Now, my car is in perfect working condition. I just uh, went through a little bit of a mess getting it all set up. So I wanted to make this video quick and easy. A um, couple things you need to know. There are three uh, fuse boxes in the car. And one of them is in the engine uh, right here next to the battery. And that's, you know, this was all put together like this, like that. So you take this cover off, and then you take this cover off, and that, you know, you've got a whole line of fuses in there. Uh, you've also got fuses in the back area, in the trunk, and this again, too, right back here. It was covered up, had a little box on it, pulled the box off, and there's your fuses right there, and that little 20 fuse. It says 20 on it, it, it might be yellow, maybe it's yellow on all of them, I don't know. That's the fuse you're gonna be using, okay? But to pull it out, we need a fuse puller. So, to get the fuse puller, we go into the instrument panel, and you take off the leather, uh, or the you take off the vinyl siding here, and you reveal uh, these fuse pullers. Now. A lot of this is in your manual, so you go into, I keep my glove compartment in the manual, open up your manual, page uh, 448 on mine uh, is a demonstration, it's actually like this, of where the fuses are. So what's important about fuses is that you replace a busted fuse uh, with the same amperage. Low amperage won't work, and high amperage will blow it out again. So um, right in here, you'll find your fuse pullers. Now I've already pulled it out, but they look like this. Okay, and what you'll do is you'll take the fuse puller from here, pull it out, there you go. You come back into the back here, and you know, first thing you gotta do is actually pull that bad boy out. So I'm actually trying to take it off the, it's a little bit tough to kind of do that. You come in here, and you take this out, and you can actually see, hang on, I'm taking it out right now. You can actually see, maybe not on this, you see the little black spot in the center, it's in the shade. You can actually see how it's burnt out. So anyway, then what you do, you find the fuse I just dropped. There it is, right there. And this is the good fuse. Put it in the fuse puller. And put it right back in. And, uh, and there you go. And you've replaced the fuse. So now all your car systems should be a go. Now, 